What's going on everybody? It's your boy CDS Shorty. Always teaching. Always at a truck stop. So look, what you want on your trailer, especially if you're going to be an owner op, is you want an air ride. You want an air ride suspension. The reason why you want an air ride suspension is because it makes it more better on the, uh, the freight, you know, for the customer. Gives it a, ride, a smoother ride. So look, if y'all can see, I'm going to show y'all. If y'all can see, you got airbags on the suspension. He or she. This trailer got airbags on their suspension. This trailer, this trailer got springs. That trailer got springs, which is no air ride suspension. All right. If you got springs on the suspension, it's tough. It's hard. It's tough. It's hard. So look, oh, another trailer, airbags. So, hey, if you become an own operator, a lot of shippers will be happy when they ask you or you tell them my trailer has air ride suspension. All right. It's easier on the freight. It's for like a cushion, a softer ride. All right. So I'm just out here teaching. I'm just out here telling y'all about the different suspension, spring versus air ride. You always want that air ride. Trust me, you go to a shipper, they want that air ride. Hey, look. These little doors right here on these reefer units, they they little doors to air out the trailer. You know, if you got a heavy meat load or something like that, that's real bloody, what it does is it airs out the trailer. And on these reefers, I'm gonna see if I can get up under here. On these reefers, the blood and the water, there's three little holes. There's a hole right there, hole right there, and a hole right there that will drain, it will drain. The trailer will automatically drain itself. So. Let's see if we can get up under here and see. Yep, there it go right there. That's the hole right there that a bunch of y'all probably didn't know. All right. <clears throat> that makes it easier for a trailer washout too. All right, so look. Like I say, hey man, air ride suspension. Prime. They got air ride suspension. And also, what a lot of y'all don't know about Prime, too, you know, this economy is terrible. You know, the rates is low, all of that. But see, with Prime, you know mostly they run reefer. They run refrigerator, groceries, and stuff like that. They got a direct contract, a direct shipper contract. That's the only reason why they're able to stay alive, because they got a contract. All right? So that's the thing with Prime. They got a contract. You go to Prime, you're always going to stay running because they done built contracts up. All right, that's why they can run in this economy like that and afford to pay their drivers and pay themselves and have all this nice stuff and the millennia building and all that I see on YouTube. But look, they got air ride, air ride suspension. They know what's up. All right, man. So I'm gonna cut this video, man. But hey, like I said, baby, air ride suspension versus spring suspension. And KW, I'm a Kenworth type of guy. KWs and Peter uh, Peterbelts, they hold their value. They hold their value. And the older Freightliners hold their value too. The newer Freightliners and these newer trucks that are called plastic garbage cans, they don't hold their value. They don't hold their value. Now they do come with the death system on it, which is a bad thing, but Hey, it is what it is. But they don't have the Bendix system. They don't have none of that. You got a freight line and you see that little square thing right there? You got a Bendix system, which is automatic braking, which is terrible. And then it got all the sensors and stuff, which is terrible. So it actually stresses the driver out more to drive the truck versus doing the job. But then again, you got people that don't know anything about trucking making these damn trucks so like i said man hey you get your international if you want to that's a terrible truck especially if it's got a max force engine in it we call it maxi pad terrible truck get you get you an international if you want to you're gonna be broke down on the road you know what we call them right intertrationals hey man i'm always bringing y'all information Thank y'all.
for trucking with me.